Hello everyone, it's me Nishita Koirala from Medical Experience Library. So your video is that you guys are just a week away from CE and I know you will do very well and nothing can go wrong. But uh, what about negative marking? I should know that. There is an idea that we are going to have negative marking, tensions, and we are going to have a lot of negative marking, and we are going to have a lot of frustrated. But don't worry guys. In fact, it's for making exam more proficient since CE is a competitive exam. All you need are few exam skills as topping on your hard work. So let's understand how negative marking works in CE. Right answer is plus 1, wrong answer is minus 0.25. That means 4 wrong answers are equal to 1 marks. See, this ratio is already in favor of you. This is plus 1, this ratio is already in favor of you. This is plus 1, this ratio is already in favor of you. This is plus 1, how you will handle your questions. And so, there are 4 conditions that you can see. Sure answer is plus 1, then go for it, obviously. And the question is plus 1, plus 1, plus 1. And in 2 choices, there is confusion. That means 50% of the probability. So think, in this case, wrong answer by 0.25 and the right answer by 1 mark sounds are going to be searched. So answer right answer is going to be wrong answer like and you will get the right answer. This is the question. The question is that the idea is don't feel anything. Another negative mark pile up and you will get the right answer. And if you have a lot of confusion in the question, don't feel. I suggest that always see the probability for answers to get right and act accordingly. समा ट्राई अवॉइडिंग नेगेटिव मार्किंग है फिर कई ना उन्हें क्वेश्चन में अपनी ना तुक्का आंधे ही मेरे गॉड फीलिंग लिस्ट तो बने को बने रा आंसर्स लिखना मिलता ही ना बट दिस आल्सो डजन मीन कि यू वांट इवन सी द क्वेश्चंस एंड लिव एवरीथिंग नो सो यस डोंट पैनिक अवॉइड एंजाइटी है � and believe in yourself, cautiously exam the year, don't go to the exam. If you think about the negative marking, you can't go to the questions, so don't do that. Read questions properly, not accept, as the words are in many cases, so focus on your questions first. And manage your time well, this is the key, keep it simple. Take a deep breath and give your exam thinking, in these three hours, whatever happens, I'll give my best and get out of the exam hall at last with no regrets. So thank you everyone, this is it, all the best for your exam.